hi welcome to my channel in this video i will create installer from java application so this video tutorial um, requires three tools first is you need to download or install netbeans ide 8.2 then the second one is launch for j3.14 then the third one is you need to install eno setup compiler 5.5.9 then let's proceed uh, we need to create installer from this project LMS so library management system it is located to documents folder so this is the LMS from documents so this is the inside the project there's uh, six folders so before we proceed to an installer we need to create jar file so tools output okay so let's create um let's create jar file so to this project so right click this project then click clean and build so creating jar file so it is located from this LM, documents lms this so here there is a disk folder then let's try to run this it requires um this lms util that can pick that i in i so let's proceed to source copy this folder then put in the disk paste then um delete the unnecessary file so delete this one then delete these folders then okay delete this one only this config remains so here um after after adding the source so we need to try let's run so there's a um login form so let's try to log in if it is uh, we need to test if it is connected to database so it is connected to database so i will share it to you this project so that you can try okay here um the second one is we need to create exe not installer but exe so here we need to browse the output we need to put in this okay so let's put uh, lms don't forget to add exe file dot exe lms dot exe or any name of your installer then put that i i dot exe then save then next is browse the jar file the next is browse the icon to add um icon to your exe so it's okay down here downloads then this one icon open then next is you need set the class path of your project then check this custom class path then click this folder then proceed to my documents then lms then this then select this lms because this uh, lms has um has main class of the project then open so this is the main class then this is the um, jar files include so here next is we need to check the uh, no, to uh, click this tab I, gre then select add we need to add here the minimum of um, gre is 1.6 then it is okay if we add uh we need to put uh, 1.8 but uh, we need to put minimum then the 
maximum maximum GRA version is uh, today is 18 but we need to put 17 it's okay if you put 20 it's okay but I need to put um, requirements minimum requirements so there's no error with this um, version of GRE so it's okay then that's all then click this button build wrapper then put in um, this here double click then we need to put uh, for example as npu uh, exc or lms lms exc npu okay so save then it is created there's added here is lms this is not installer but exc so let's proceed to that exc here um, double click this one if we double click this folder you see almost the same function of lms jar so i need to try so here okay same same but this is not installer so we need to create this uh this project as installer so proceed to you know, set up here uh, click new to new create new install setup the next is proceed for example you need to put um, LMS okay LMS application name that uh, AXC then this is the version for example then let's put um, application publisher is Aldrin uh, Pro um, okay then next then the default destination of the base folder is uh, program files so this is a uh, destination it's okay the default if you want to change to program files if you want to change it to C it's okay but it is this is installer so it is good default um, then next is the location of the exe file so browse then need to find the lms file here that is this this one add open then there's a uh, application main executable file so let's add folder here then to your program then let's proceed to pc then documents then proceed to lms then this then this one uh, requires add folder then this okay so this then it's okay because all we need is this folder inside the disk so here we need to pro next click this button next then next then browse the license file so for example uh, let's put readme this is the example if you want to create um license file then create so i don't have time then that's i need to select that as a dummy the next is next then this is custom compiler output then the output is we need to put in you see documents then um lms uh, where is it LMS then this then okay then set up a uh, name base is LMS set up okay now set up that exe then browse the 
icon of your application insta or installer so proceed to downloads then click this icon that i ico then next then next then finish then you would like to compile the new script now this is the script then yes then you would like to save the script before scripting yes then let's put the uh, here documents then lms then this then let's put uh, this is a uh, script so lms input a uh, script so so that's it it is created compiling the jar file so let's proceed to okay to this this okay refresh so we have uh, lms set up here we need to try this um okay we need to try this uh, application so first is right click run as, as administrator then uh, click yes then accept the ag accept, accept the agreement then next then next then the default folder is program files then next then create shortcut uh, this uh, create a desktop shortcut then next then install then click finish uh, finish so we have program here so let's try to close the program let's minimize so we have ixc here then let's try to run okay then admin then enter so we create an installer to to the uh, from java application so successfully so i will share it to you the project lms where you to download uh, find it in the description so don't forget to subscribe and like my video if you like it then see you next video bye, -bye.